Oh, so you thought I was going to find out. You thought I wasn't going to find out. Come on. Spider-Man PS4? Spider-Man PS4. Spider-Man PS4. Yo, yo. Spider-Man PS4? Y'all think I was going to find out about this? I got it. See, y'all just didn't think I was going to find out about this, right? Y'all think I was going to find out about this, right? Right, right. Come on now. Spider-Man, PS4, my guy? See, alright. Y'all already know. Kingpin. Spider-Man boss fight. Game Informer. Y'all already know what we on. Y'all already know what we on, my guys. So let's get let's get started. Let's get on with this reaction real quick. And for the first time, and we learned all right, all right. moments of the game that Kingpin falls right away. Like Peter Parker. So is he wearing the classic Spider-Man suit or no? Down for five years, roughly, since Peter Parker became Spider-Man, and this is his big moment, his big victory, where he finally takes down Kingpin and uh -huh. thinks that things are going to be better in the city. The weird thing about this visit is that we learned about this moment. But they didn't show it to us. We didn't see what happened. I need this game, man. Fisk, you know, in his tower, being triumphant, and then we saw him behind bars, basically, in a police car. Yeah, and he looked disheveled. He looked as though he had been beaten up by a person with spider powers. But that's that's all we saw. But you went back to and saw him recently, and you actually got right. to participate in that boss. Bro, we need, yeah, bro, we need this game to come out like game, now, bro. Like, oh, look at that classic Spider-Man like, suit, my guy. Sound like a fresh in the mud. The battle... Like most God of War games, where that first boss fight you have is huge oh, in scale know. and just like two titans throwing down. Yeah, that's exactly what happens here. Uh, I don't want to detail exactly what happens in the fight, but Fisk is basically a raging bull. It doesn't matter what he hits, he will go through it. Yeah, Dang. that includes walls, ceilings, floors. I mean, this is a multi-story fight that that uh, unfolds. This is dope. And a lot of times you're just along for the ride, and you're being—it's kind of being dictated. You thought where good. This is taking you. Yeah, I mean, he's well, around a lot. Like he game keeps rough, up with Spider-Man. Like he has—he seems to have comparable strength. He even tries to like secure himself in this like in this room, and Spider-Man just like breaks through it, and he just breaks his desk in anger in an attempt to like intimidate Spider-Man. I guess I don't know. Yeah, like all good supervillains, you would assume that they think one, the cops might show up someday, and two, maybe a superhero. So he has prepared, like, so, yeah, this so tower is uh, kind of a fortress, and when things go bad there, the defenses uh, come up, and uh, you have to deal with those as well. Were there a lot of QTEs? There's a few. Uh, like oh, playing the Uncharted game, you want to keep your hand on the controller. Look like, at when that! When happening, you just never know what's going to happen. Uh, there's one moment uh, as the building's being destroyed where I had Look to free... Look at spider uh, Oh, man, it was employees, so dope! You know, just standard civilians uh, from beneath rubble, and that was a moment where... Once Spider-Man got his fingers under the rubble, I had to lift it up, uh, jamming on the, the square button. And that just happened like in the middle of the boss fight. Like you had to take this care of This is just a moment where you're running to the next sequence. Oh, okay. But there was one moment where I'm oh, free falling like this. Feels. Look at the and graphics. Look how buttery smooth this is, bro. Uh, timing buttons. You know, this wasn't jamming on the buttons. This was like a matter of timing to shoot webs. Oh, or, so, okay, you know, okay. So, not, so, so, so not, not a bad man. When you were doing what was the combat like? Were you doing like combos or... Uh, I don't want to give away all the, the strategies, but you're doing a bunch of different things at different stages in the fight. It's a That's lit, so it's not just a freaking Batman type, where, uh, but at one point you're, type you're, you're relying you know it's just like, on more of your melee, other times you really gotta kind of like, you gotta no, be more resourceful. But think of strategy, I like that, I like that. Oh yeah, yep. But in the aftermath of it, you, you know, you again, you see Fisk get put in the, the police van, whisked away to the prison, but... That's not the last you hear of him here. And I'm not saying you're going to hear him, like, on a phone. You're not going to call him. Well, 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 you know, his, his, uh, his people are still I don't know, that's like probably the one of the biggest struggles of the Spider-Man game uh, is getting the wedding band, man. But there's another force that's coming in to take that down. crazy. And they even have some missions that are kind of the aftermath. One of the ones that I played was the estate sale. So they're starting to, like, get rid of all of his belongings that were probably in Fist Tower, right, that it's been seized now. Uh, one of them is, uh, I don't want to, again, give away a lot of it. There's a lot of old, you know, priceless paintings and statues and stuff like that. But one of them is a cello that he has behind this glass case. Talk and about that Avengers freaking tower. It's named Vanessa. Look it up. 
Yeah, so it's, it's like, oh, should I be excited about that? Okay. But I think that's cool that they have kind of this continued legacy. Usually when a boss goes down, that's kind of the end of it, right? You get the uh, hey, trophy nice. or whatever. Oh, that's, okay. That's the end I'm about of to it. say, Spider-Man getting no violent out this second? Like it's kind of bleeding along as this new threat is, is starting to arise. Well, it's exciting because there was oh, a look at these graphics, the my guy. Insomniac, you, know, you done did it again. And it, it made me think... Oh, Bruh, so but that so we can so we can I guess we need to play uh, cl play classic Spider Man. So for, for is that like a memory or something? Is that like a like, oh, no, no. He's like, something you'll have to like achieve? Is that him, a flashback? Like uh, what is that? Just to be the, the starting line for the game, and that's that's exciting. That's really awesome. And you have to wonder, like at Scorpio, E3 this year, we saw that sequence where they introduced the uh, Rhino. Sense. Yeah. But the prison's being destroyed. There's a you know a riot going on at the prison. Does Kingpin get out there? Like. Will you fight him again? Will he join up with, with the Sinister Six? Uh, there's a lot of questions that, that we still need answers to, but uh, I really liked what I played. I thought the boss fight was really well done. Intense. Okay, all right, intense. All right, I like that. I like that. I like that. Uh, uh, yeah, that's just the first one. Like, you're going to become more powerful as the game goes on, so you're going to... Wait, how long is the game? Bro, I hope the game is really later no, no, no. Especially, I mean, you got to take down all, all of the Sinister Six at some point. Yeah, well, I hope so. He's yeah, got yeah, that whole to go. You right? But your foolishness ends now. Get out of here, Kingpin. Pinhead. Alright. That was tough. That was tough. That was cool. Pretty good gameplay trailer. If I, if I have to do, say, how do you say that? I do say so myself, by the way. Well, it's exciting because there was a game to game lie there, they... buddy. Not going to lie there, buddy. Gameplay was really good. I really love how smooth the gameplay looks like. I love how the graphics look Somniac. These are people that made freaking Ratchet and Clank. I love how the graphics look, the gameplay looks, the movement, the webbing looks a lot better. Everything in this game just looks top notch. My only complaint is, it, I'm not complaining, but my only worry is, yeah, 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 yeah. A lot of people are paying attention to the webbing. Of course, you gotta, you gotta pay attention to the webbing. Graphics, okay. Game, but how is that story going to be, my guy? Will the story be cheesy on some Amer amazing Spider-Man type, amazing Spider-Man one and two type time? Are we actually getting an original story? Are we getting something fresh, brand new material? You know, none of that movie BS. Are we getting something good, original story, just something fresh, brand new, like we, something that we never ever seen before? All right, because I don't want none of the. I, I want a fresh Spider-Man game. I want a story that's really great. I want everything to be good in this game. I want this game to be game like be like game of the year. I want this game to be better than God of War. I want this game to be better, ten times better than God of War. All right, I want this game to be up there like game of the year. I want this game to win game of the year. Cause let me tell you, I don't see Red Dead Redemption two touch in this game. I'm sorry. I don't. As much as I'm looking forward to that game, I don't see that game touching this. I'm sorry. For what I've been seeing so far, Red Dead what? Red Dead who? Get out of here. Small about that spider, 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 spider. Yeah, spider, spider. It's all about that spider. You know what I mean? So that's what I'm looking forward to. Um, Hopefully the game is good, bro. I don't want this game to flop. I want this game to be piping cells, bro. No, I want this game to be really honest. I don't want I, I don't want this game to be bad. I need this game now. Oh bro, what they should do is release a demo or, or something like that. Release a demo for I brought that. Or beta like just a demo or something, man, please. Cause like listen, I can't be the only person that wants to play the mess out of this game. Even that even if it has to be like one mission where we have to play over and over again. Just let us play Insomniac. Let us play it, please. Cause I need this game in my life, man. I need this, bro. Like, this is something that I've been looking forward to since, like, back in 2016 when it first got revealed by a guy. But there's, there's still some people that's kind of like, yeah, I don't know. This game might not be that good. Trust me. Have you seen them graphics though. And I'm not really much of a graphic horror, but I mean I know graphic I know good graphics when I see it, you know what I'm saying? But like the gameplay was beautiful. Like everything in this game was top notch. The only thing is we have to worry about is the story. That's about it. Everything else is good. But let's see how that story is though. Let's see what that story looks like. Nobody's even talking about that. So 
Let's see what that starting mode looking like. That starting mode clean, then this game might actually be something amazing. See what I did there? But anyway, my fellow talkers, thank you so much for the support, man. Let's get to 500 subscribers. Well, damn, my fault. 600 subscribers, man. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with me. Let's get to 600 subscribers, guys. Thank you so much for the support. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, man. Blah. Stay, stay, stay fresh. It's your boy, King Mark Entertainment. And uh, yeah, bye, Z. My fellow otaku.